Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Aziz Sani bin Zaibi and I'm from class DC 2C. Did you guys ever think about what is the most powerful and the fastest moped in Malaysia? Some of you guys probably say Waisuku. No. Some of you guys RS. No. It is SYM Battery I. LE. What does it have? Okay, for the first, it has adjustable clutch and adjustable brake. It also got full LED light. They right? Not right. No worries. It will shine like hot. Beautiful speedometer. So, what about the spec? So, let me tell you guys. The engine. 183 cc single cam radiator this this motorcycle can produce to up to 90.7 horsepower even 1 to 5 can't handle this motor guys must question me so what about the top speed so let me show you guys okay, that come, that come. it can go up to 150 km per hour so why should we r15 rs the same empty no one can fit this motorcycle more come with six gear transmission abs front and also at the back y16 no abs and you know what is the most important thing this motor have the most, the biggest full tank capacity in Cup Chai generation with 7.1 liter R15. <laughs> so, long ride with this motorcycle. <laughs> no worries. Pinang to Kuala Lumpur. Just fill with 12 ringgit. You can, you can go Pinang, Kuala Lumpur, Kuala Lumpur, Pinang. Ten ringgit, not even full tank. That's how hurt I am using this motorcycle. That's okay, seven liter. Uh, you can you can go up to like maybe a week, you know. So very good. Yeah. What about the sound? So, let me show you guys. Cycle, you don't have to really put a lot of budget in it let's say for the insurance uh, it's only around like 300 or to 600 ringgit and for the road tax it's only cost you 30 ringgit and you don't really need like a special license for it just a normal license it's good to go and don't also forget that to make sure this motorcycle in a very good condition every 10,000 kilometers change your oil filter and every 20,000 kilometer uh, just do an overall service so that your motorcycle always be in a good condition and for an oil check and everything for the oil engine um, maybe around if you using like an ex expensive one maybe like three four months and if using like a normal one maybe every one one month 
uh, you have to change it regularly so the engine will running smoothly. And a little, a little history about these motorcycles. Um, and the first first version is just SYM VFTRI, then came out SYM VFTRI LE, then SYM VFTRI Pro, then another that after that SYM VFTRI LE V2, then the last one is SYM VFTRI V2. So let me tell you guys a secret for a little modification advice. If you if you guys want to make this more a little bit faster, turn down the fork, uh, change ECU, change block, and just like a, a slimmer tire. Uh, trust me, guys. Two hundred kilometers of power, no, no problem. Oh, also, uh, change the cover set, uh, a trimmer cover set. Okay. So, but uh, and exhaust, where the exhaust? And for the exhaust. Uh, uh, just uh, you, use whatever you want, but if police call you, don't, don't ever blame me, okay? So that's all for my review today. Thank you guys. So if you just want to buy a motorcycle brand new, uh, I recommend my baby. You can, you can buy it for maybe like 8,000 maybe. So I really recommend this motor. Here you go.